What's up, guys? So it looks like Crunchyroll is starting to put out the nominees for their yearly anime awards show. And I thought it would be a little interesting to see and talk about the nominees they have for the anime of the year. So it looks like they have Bochi the Rock, Chainsaw Man, Demon Slayer, Kimetsu no Yaiba, Swordsman Village Arc, Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2, Oshinoko, and Vinland Saga Season 2. Now, honestly, all these are excellent animes, if not some probably being above others. But let's go ahead and eliminate the obvious ones that I don't think really stand a chance on this list and that's gonna be bochi chainsaw man and oshinoko and vinland saga now these are all really excellent animes with good stories you know bochi was a great anime that season definitely different from everything that was out at the time uh chainsaw man even though it kind of failed to impress i mean it still had a amazing opening song and the anime was almost a one-to-one -one adaptation from the manga which might have actually been to its detriment uh vinland saga season two i think was just way too different from what one was and being an anime only watcher it wasn't what i had come to expect from vinland saga so I don't even think I finished the season personally. And I know there was some hype moments that was going around, but I just don't think it really compares to some of the other shows on this list. Now, Oshinoko had a very strong opening. And I mean, even the the opening song charted at number one here in the u.s on the on the billboard list which never has never happened before but the type of show that oshinoko is which is a mystery drama suspense it just isn't gonna cut it and i mean that that's why i think that demon slayer and jujutsu kaisen are kind of the only two picks i mean demon slayer had a very strong season with the swordsmith village art great animation hype moments about every other episode the, the ending where nezuko finally kind of awakens and we get to hear her speak for the first time since the beginning of the show really really strong season i just really think there's only one obvious answer and that's jujutsu kaisen season two because really once the shibuya incidents started that anime did not let up at all and it definitely had the best animation of last year and we all know that the visuals and anime is definitely what brings people in and the story is what keeps you watching over and over again yeah, i'm just very surprised that there's some anime that just aren't on here like mashal bleach trigun you know a few others that aired last year i mean that's what i think is going to happen maybe we'll go over a few of the others on the on stream but uh i'm curious to know what y'all think of my thoughts so leave a comment in the comments below and uh tell me your thoughts uh like y'all think i'm like spot on or nah nah my bochi's got this dude you're completely forgetting chainsaw man i mean i i just really think that considering that jujutsu kaisen season two just ended it's the most precious anime on this list in people's minds that i just can't see how it's not going to win if that makes sense uh but guys let me know in the comments what y'all's thoughts are and uh, i'll see y'all in the next one